this is abacha i need to try making abacha guys hello v scott how are you all doing happy sunday happy sunday i hope everybody's doing okay is that all right quite here oh yesterday saturday i tried to film i did not film okay tiredness knock your girl out i did not film so those of you coming across this channel for your first time you're welcome my name is vera please consider subscribing to join the v squad okay we love you all here okay yeah baby girls in the background saying hello say hello Hi. she's there eating empty spaghetti <laughs> Oh my god guys today i just thought of um picking up my camera and starting mommy's talking you have already said hello didn't you say hi yes yeah, say hello hi Yari. <laughs> okay now we have two vloggers in this house <laughs> keep it down please it's not only mommy that loves to vlog okay baby girl is my companion she is my all the time to go with okay she's my supporter my number one fan so she's also loving the camera apart from her everybody else running away from the camera so i have somebody cheering me okay all right so this is sunday morning it's already afternoon anyway and i'm having a cup of coffee oh my god I want to tell this story concerning avocados. I'm going to stop buying avocados in my house, okay? Because when I buy avocados, I end up keeping them go to waste. See? Can you see this? And these were so expensive. I bought four of them. I think they only had one and three all going to the bin. So I think I will only buy avocado when I'm using it immediately because I always buy the ones that are not ready yet so that they get ready with time then i can use it but i've been busy i wasn't around so now they get spoiled nobody ate it that's the story gone money gone so right now we have to avoid wasting money i'm not going to be buying avocado again <laughs> ah this has not this has been happening not once not twice not three times many times so i have to stop buying avocado except i have a visitor who really want avocado then i buy it and they eat it i love avocado but i don't know for some reason when i buy them i forget to eat them then they spoil so yeah i have been having this heat guys please can you guys give me advice i have this issue with sweating i can sweat a bucket a day I'm sweating and sweating and sweating non-stop. I mean non-stop. I will just wake up, have my shower, then get dressed. As soon as I'm getting dressed, I'm starting sweating. I know I have an issue with my thyroid. For those of you who know, I have over overactive thyroid. So my body metabolism acts really, really fast. So my system is always working faster than it should if it makes sense that's just a simpler way to explain what overactive thyroid is so it makes me always feeling heat guys i can see it even winter time is freezing cold people are wearing jackets i will be sweating like sweating so it's getting out of hand now. i'm getting so tired about it okay i'm getting frustrated you see i want to go somewhere i'll dress nice wear my nice makeup before you know it boom I start sweating and everything is a mess and when i start sweating like that when i'm among people i start sweating like that i feel so uncomfortable and that that way it makes me sweat more so any advice in the comment section anybody going through this whole thing so i'm thinking to go to my doctor and ask them if they could give me something to stop sweating because it's just it's just not it's just making me feel sick emotionally mentally you know so yeah i just wanted to vent here maybe somebody in the comment section will have something to tell me maybe they're going through the same thing they might advise me people say oh you can wear non loose clothes i'm not somebody that wear tight fitting clothes i just wear loose things i don't really like fitting fitting hawking clothes because it would just make matters worse so oh uh, I'm confused by the way 
I'm going to be taking you guys through my Sunday. Okay, I don't know what we're going to be doing. I needed to go to the shop, but yesterday I was at my family place. We were busy sorting out the garden. I started work after that, then I forgot my bag there with my purse. I have money inside my cart, everything is there. This morning when I got dressed, I said, let me step out to the shop and pick the few things that I need. My purse is nowhere to be found. My cart, although I have Apple Pay on my phone, but I don't want to use my cart right now. I'll need, I have a physical cash with me that I need to use and it's in this bag. So I don't know what to do. Maybe I will maybe I won't go shopping. Just stay at home. Then tomorrow morning when I drop a big gear, I can go pick up the stuff I need. I'm not too sure yet, but in case I go to pick up the bag and end up shopping, I will let you guys know, okay? Baby girl, can you stop eating that spaghetti like that? Guys, do you guys uh, do you does your kids eat uh empty spaghetti with that sauce in it my daughter loves to eat just empty spaghetti with that sauce even rice she just wants to eat white rice with that sauce or anything on it so right now she's eating empty spaghetti with that sauce all right i've been talking i've been venting a lot but i hope i can get an advice from this venting okay i'll see you guys in the next clip story of my life guys today something happened something crazy happened yeah I was just you guys. It's all about just it. I will tell you guys something happened. <laughs> Ooh, this life not balanced. So let me get into the car. Hmm. African shop. This is the African shop. Which fish are we taking? I don't want to. I don't want to. Not a big, big lady, no, no. You see that big one that we zit that we bring up for that occasion. No, no, zit that we bring. Yeah, the big. I need to see that thirty-nine pound big box fish. Then she said, "Very big." This is the African shop. I made it to the African shop today, guys. Guys, come and see Plum Hill. Look at plums. Pear. We have pear here, guys. Two nights. Now we have a cut. That As a big gift party, can so sad today, they go drag it with it. Guys, this is abacha. I need to try making abacha, guys. You guys need to give me how many super much I bring. I've got this feeling. I'm feeling you could be the one. I see no reason why I should ever let you go. Me I, I really need to buy ice cream more. Can you see me my ice again? <laughs> yeah. I can not know not I don't want to wake up. Hello, Abby. You can drop them down here. If the camera not there around. We're going to be making chicken today. 
making some fried rice can you all see the chicken we're having a party today always party party you're welcome anytime into my house into my family <laughs> we always have party going on okay and this angle here we have fish so we're going to be doing barbecue fish as well okay so i've just chopped some onions and tomatoes and here yeah, our meat is cooking <laughs> i can't wait to take you guys along this day today hey you guys are going to enjoy eating this food with us yummy 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 quick one i'm having some wine guys you know i love when i'm cooking i'm drinking at the same time so i'm having some red wine here and i have my crew there oh ta -da! we are having some roasted corn today see this is a new method guys just put your corn if you have an air fryer just put your fresh corn in the air fryer and you toast it just put it on roasted before you know it you're having delicious roasted corn especially for those of us abroad you know it's hard for us to have the roasted corn as compared to those of you back in africa you're having your roasted corn every day so <laughs> ciao ciao here we have our pear. My Nigerian people call this pear, but in Cameroon we call it plum. We're going to be having it with the roasted corn, guys. Join us, okay? Feel free to join us. Sweet corn is ready, guys. We almost burn it literally, but it's still good to go. So, yeah, we are going to be having this with some plum, some pear. Come and join us, fam. V squad, just for you people, okay? Come and join us. It's ready. Who said we cannot eat roasted corn in the UK? Who said so? Here's a chicken we are making. Chicken barbecue. Linus barbecue. In America, everything looks dirty. Is it not the same like this in America? Yeah, their own thing is really look like it looks dirty. So we are blessing the UK. My American fans, I know I have a lot of American fans watching me. You guys, you see our UK chicken. Let me know. You all have this fresh, your malicious looking chicken in America. <laughs> now we're marinating the chicken. Look at that. The juiciness. Today mm, 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 mm. My papa got the shower we use. This is the sauce we're using. And there is the chicken we marinate. We will see you all when we are roasting it. Huh? This is the rice we are going to be making our... It's fried rice we are making, right? Making fried rice. No! You want no, ice cream? Who want ice cream? No ice cream. Who want ice cream? No ice cream. Sabira, you want ice cream? No. Yes, I want ice cream. Which one you want, Abigail? I want ice cream. Take. I want ice cream. Oh, it's a popsicle. She want popsicle. Take. I want popsicle too. You want popsicle? Come on, take. Here you go. You're welcome. You're welcome. Should I open it? Try opening. Our fried rice is coming so nicely, guys. We're about to put the rice. I thought you were about to pour the rice in. I'm a damn good set. Fried rice in the making. <laughs> the fried rice is given it's rising guys come on eat fried rice so fried rice is ready <laughs> sunday rice typical african sunday rice yeah come on eat fried rice it's given the given <laughs> I am the tester here, yeah? 
Maybe not, your uncle. We are doing some barbecue chicken, guys. Yummy, yummy, yummy. The good weather cannot be wasted, okay? So we're making you some big barbecue. Uh oh, Abby, everyone is going. Uh oh. Lucas, don't cry, they are coming back, okay? Oh God. Guys, we had visitors around, so we were eating and gisting. I didn't show you guys, you know, but they just left now, and my nephew is crying. He wants to follow the visitors and go with them, so the house is in the chaos right now. Oh, we have been eating, drinking, you know, but so far this is already about 8 o'clock, and yeah, you can see it's getting dark now. Our fish is still cooking here, see, I'm still cooking the fish here, but I'll be ending this vlog here, okay guys, we're going to be ending the vlog here, thank you guys so, so much for watching, see, I come your way again next time, please give this video a thumbs up, it's dark outside, okay, you guys should not come for me, it's dark already, that's why I'm in the garden, roasting the fish, we are finishing up now, your face is not showing. Look, they are running away! <laughs>